Welcome back, folks, to Let's Play Resident Evil 2 for the PS1. I'm Samurai Tix, and this gameplay is brought to you by MuchGames.ca. And when we last left off, we uh, met Annette, and uh, what else did we do? Um, we um, we did grab the um, P key, and we did run around this room and um, got extra Mugnum parts and whatnot. So, yes, I'm mocking the game for actually calling it a, mag a Magnum Mugnum. So, yeah, we're going back this way because we got the key, and that key being, um, that key being um, the thing we need to go progress this way. All right, let's shoot you with the Mugnum. Oops. All right, that's two shots. He should have killed you the second time. Oh, we're dying. You know what? We're going to continue to soldier on, literally, so... One thing I liked about this game is the fact that when you're wounded, you actually get to see um, the character hold its sides. In Resident Evil 1, you didn't particularly see that, so if you was in danger, you'd run normal, but in this, you would actually, um, you actually see your injuries when you're in caution or whatnot. When you're in danger, you hobble. You saw me hobble quite a bit. Right, as, um, I think the maximum rank you can get in this game isn't an S. I think it's an A. I keep saying S rank, but it's an A. I think even if you be in under um, an hour, not an hour, sorry, in under two hours and 30 minutes and whatnot, you still get an, um, you still get an A rank. So yeah, no matter how quick we beat this game, I think we're still going to get it in um, an A rank. So yeah, I think that's the goal. A rank. I think we still unlock everything with the A rank. So that's good stuff. But yeah, this is the last video for Leon scenario, um, scenario B, because, um, we're basically at the last part, so yeah, no no saving. It's been a while since I last did um, a video on Resident Evil 2. I think it was um, <coughs> New Year's Eve before I uploaded during the New Year. Well, I uploaded on New Year's Eve to make you enjoy the video for New Year's Day. But um, this will be the finale of Leon's scenario, so yeah, we're gonna, I'll be, we, I will be playing all the games. But for now, let's um, continue running this way. And hello, who's that? No. Take it from me. This is my husband's legacy. Now, Your husband's a madman now. You know who I'm talking about. What? You really don't know anything, do you? <laughs> You're so gullible. She's one of the operatives sent here by the agency. The only reason why she came here is to obtain the G virus. That's a lie. No, it's the truth. I discovered this when I did a background check on her. She specifically got close to John and became his girlfriend to get information about him. That can't be. I know her. Ada wouldn't do something like that. You don't know her long enough, Leon. Convenient, she says the word you're going to die this time, and this guy arrives. Great! Normally, it's me that's going to die whenever I say the word. Ouch. And he's down already. Of course, he is. After how many shots of the Magnum? I think four. Right, let's pick up the ammo. Thank you. And we're gonna go this way. Because we still gotta go this way for obvious reasons. Because we have the power key, so yeah, we do need to go this way. So the T zombie slash Mr. X is down for now. We're going to heal ourselves because he punched us, so we're going to need at least two healing items, which is fine by me. So we're going to use this one and this one. Let's upgrade our health. There we go. Um, funny that the thing was a yellow line, considering we was on fine, but it's okay. Alright, let's push the switch. And now we're going to um, try and beat this game. Without making any errors. So at least we got the Magnum to use. Yeah, this will be the last gun we'll use in the game. Because we got um, 48 clip, well 49 if you count the one in my gun. But yeah, let's go this way and use the P-Room key. Useless, let's go. Let's open this door. And we're going to go this way now. So do 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 do
Oh, don't you just give up already. Please, leave me alone. Oh, God. We're trapped in a corner, aren't we? Oh, God. Run. Uh, we can't run elsewhere, Ada. Oh, no! Oh, good shooting. Oh, dear. That must have did something bad. Oh, look. Something fell out of there. Bye-bye! <laughs> Yakety-yak, don't come back! Leon, please, escape. No. We're a team. I can't just leave you behind. I'm just a woman. You fell in love with you. Nothing more. We only just met hours ago. How can you fall in love with me? Okay, I guess the situation is a bit different considering this is a zombie outbreak, but still. Really? Ada, what's your status? Ada! Perfect timing, Leon. The bottom platform, platform, platform. Well, it looks like there's something shiny on the floor, so I'm going to pick it up. But yes, we're going to avenge you, Ada, even though... Leon is a bit naive. I'm not. You're not really dead. I'm sure you're not. Because, well... Some people just tend to not die in this game. I mean, the monsters don't tend to die, so I don't see why you tend to die. Speaking of which, look at this thing! Leave me alone! Stop stalking me! I don't have your number! Just go! I don't want to date you! Wait a second! What are you gonna do? Where are you going? I still have a few exams to take care of. I'm counting on you. Hello? Claire, are you there? Claire! The security office? Yep, the security office is on the... Um, in the laboratory. <laughs> yeah, we keep walking past that room because we had no access to it, but now we probably will, so... Yeah, let's upgrade our health and whatnot. Well, not upgrade it because we haven't been damaged, but we're going to go inside the same box and um, just grab a few health items. We're not going to grab too many. Now, let's go this way and uh, mix up some herbs. So, we're going to grab carry three health items. So, one, two, uh, wait, okay. There we go. Combine. Combine. Alright, let's get another blue herb. I'll receive to the bottom platform. I think that's the final blue herb we have, actually. So we got three combinations. That's good enough for me for now. Until we actually um, discard some items. We got a master key, so for now, we I think it's only going to be used in two places. We need to use it in the elevator as it says beforehand and um, the other time I think it's going to be used for a door actually <laughs> alright so let's use the master key here yes emergency elevator activate good stuff and now Leon's going to say I have to go back for Sherry yes Leon we know oops I did not mean to do that I meant to do it this way fast forward this sorry I only fast forward it to slow down to f quicken the um, elevator sequence. But now we're going to continue going. The bottom platform, platform. Alright. Sherry, we're coming to save you. Sherry, where are you, Sherry? Let's open it with this. Yep, we're going to have to throw it away now. And Sherry should be in here. 
I believe Claire locked the door, but either way, at least we're gonna save some sherry now. Save some sherry. I mean, save sherry. Yes, Claire's waiting for you, Sherry. We have a job to do, and we gotta escape. Well, you. Um, I have to carry you, but... You're pretty much not in, in a bad situation, considering that Leon can carry you, and there ain't no zombies. Right, now let's press this to go down. So let's press the uh, emergency elevator. And yep, we're going through. So the train should be down here, and this is going to be our emergency escape. We're not going to use the um, we're not going to use the thing because we need the space. All the time you have to leave the space, leave the space for the inventory. I would go in there to grab another herb or something, but I'm not going to. Alright, so put you down here. Yep. Actually, you know what? I'm going to grab a herb. I'm going to grab a health pack, so... Yeah, let's go this way. Quickly grab some herb. We're going to grab a herb item. And, uh... There should be a key back here as well, actually. Yeah, can you see that shiny thing? That should be a key, so... We're going to need this key. Yes, we're going to proceed to the bottom platform, platform. Thanks for the platinum key. Uh, platform key, platinum key. God, you wish the key was platinum, Samurai. You do wish it. Right, let's grab you. Grab you. And combine you two. Because we're going to get rid of the... Um, we're going to end up getting rid of the um, platform key. And we're going to need an extra two spaces for the plug, so... Yeah, right now we're going to actually, um, what are we going to do, um, we're going to use the platform key for, um, over here, which you'll see in a minute, so let's escape. We're not escape just yet, but we need to use the platform key right here, it's going to be useless after it. There we go, discard it, because now we need the two spaces for the, uh, two plugs we need, so let's go this way, oh. Five minutes until detonation. Please proceed to the bottom platform. Platform. Right, let's go upstairs. Leon, if you stop running there, thank you. Now we're gonna go downstairs. Do 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 do. Now we're gonna go this way because we need to go this way first to grab these. So, yep, open it. And now we're gonna grab these. So grab the S south plug and the north plug. Because we need them. I wish we could carry more things, but I think Claire's the one that carries this um, extra thing. Because we took the side pack with Claire. And with Leon, we took the machine gun. Right, oh dear. So let's run this way. And let's quickly um, put the plugs here. Okay, yes, we get it. Stick them in. The emergency mode has been activated. The power supply will be cut temporarily. The emergency train will be activated upon restoration of power. Alright, you son of a bitch. I'm coming to kill you, Mr. X. You have stalked me for too long. I don't have I don't have the number you're looking for, but you have to die because you're stalking me. Ouch. Is that your way of saying um like, um, is that your way of saying, like, um, give me the number? Ow. Oh god, it wasn't equipped. It wasn't equipped, what the hell, man? I wonder why I wasn't shooting anything, it wasn't equipped. Right, there we go. Three shots, that's it? Yes, it is- ow, what the hell, man? Okay, let's grab the rocket launcher. Oh god, let's get sliced in the back first. There we go. And let's equip it. And let's run around. Turn around. Fire! Game over. Rest. In. Pieces. Boom! Sayonara, you stalker. Yep, you are dead. And don't come back, yakety yak. Right, power's restored. Let's use some herbs. Now we can run this way. Of course we can, so we're gonna escape. 
do, 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 do. Finally, the escape sequence has been up oh, running there. That would not be too clear. Leon, stop running into things. Leon, stop running into things. Of course, we're carrying this big rocket launcher. But we're going to change to our um, Magnum. Because why not? Just in case there's some zombies getting away, I'm going to blast some of their heads. But I don't really care too much for them. Because all we need to do is activate the... Um, Power and uh, we'll open the gates so that we can escape. But first, search uh, double kill, monster kill, Leon S. Kennedy, you are ridiculous kill. Right, let's press the switch, activate it for the gates. Thank you very much. And then we're going to score. One last headshot, punk. Get out of my sight, you eyesore. You deserve to die. <laughs> now we're escaping. Hooray! Oh, let's go this way first before you even think of escaping. Let's press this conveniently. Ah, we're out of here. Sayonara. Goodbye. And look at that. We're escaping, finally. Do, 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 do. Oh, Claire, there you are. Time for us to survive first, Leon, before you say goodbye to anybody. Right. And believe me, we left one big problem. Because that bugger's always been around, so we're time to resolve the issue. If only you knew, Leon. If only you knew. Alright, let's equip this, because we got a bit thing. Oh wait, let's go this way. No! What's wrong? I don't know. The door won't open. Well, it looks like we're trapped out here, so we're gonna have to go this way. But then that's a problem, because we got a problem to deal with. Yeah, something has decided to intervene for our escape, so... Looks like we got no choice but to run this way. And what the hell is that? It's a monster. But who? Oh my goodness! Believe it or not, it's William back for some vengeance. God, to this very day, I don't think Resident Evil has created a more terrifying monster than this current version of William Birkin. Look at this ugly thing. You are one ugly mother fifer. Ugh, God. Come here. Alright, big boy. Time to slay you down. And I got a magnum and a rocket with your name on it. I know it's only one bullet, but I'm still going to use it. Conveniently. Now we're going to use the magnum. Conveniently. And then we're going to reload. Fortunately, the magnum is well, has been very useful. I wish I used it longer. But let's put one more bullet in you. Okay, one more. There we go. Six shots and a rocket launcher. 
and William Birkin is officially dead. Goodbye, William. You are damaged goods. You are a lost cause the moment you actually use that serum on you, well, that virus on yourself. <clears throat> and Annette Birkin tried to defend your last creation? Not really worth it, in my opinion. But, yeah, enjoy your death, William. At least Sherry's going to be in good hands with Claire Redfield. Huh? Stubborn guy, man. Hey, Claire, I can't hear hey, you. I'm doing Mission Impossible up here. This train is moving at a fast speed. God, that's really scary, man. Imagine being in that position at Clary's under the train. That's very scary. Are you all right? I'm okay. Where's Claire? Claire? Claire! Right here. Claire! I guess we all know. We're not safe yet, Claire. No, he won't. Sayonara, William Birkin. Never to be heard from ever again. Good riddance. Even though that's Sherry's dad. It's fine, over. <coughs> Sherry, you look terrible. No, worse than you, Claire. Come on, time to leave. Now? What's wrong? Is something following us? We have to go. We don't have any time to waste. Go? Where? Hey, it's up to us to take out Umbrella. That has to be one of the most badass lines to close a video game. Trust me, I love that line. Every time I hear it, I love it. This is Resident Evil 2. Personally, my favorite one. And well, it delivered from Resident Evil 1. What a step up this game was. And the remake is even better. The replay value is there. You get at least, well... I haven't played all of it, but from playing some of it, I can tell the value that at least I'm going to have at least at least six hours or among that line for both A and B scenarios. So you're getting at least 12 hours game time plus DLC. You're going to get at least 20 hours or 18 worth of play time. It's definitely worth the money. Go and get the remake. Trust me. If you love Resident Evil as much as I do, and if you love this game, you would get that remake. For me, it's a 9 out of 10. Well, I might push it to 10 out of 10 because of the fact that the DLC is free, just like Resident Evil 7. Capcom did it right again. And I say again because the DLC... The DLC, you don't have to pay for it. It's free. It's patched in. Once I think they patched it in recently, so it's free. But yeah, what a game this is. And Alison Cool and Sally Cahill for Claire Redfield and Ada Wong, they're the voices of them too. They're irreplaceable. Alison Cool will always be Claire Redfield to me. What a fantastic voice she is for Claire. And Claire is one of my favourite Resident Evil characters, if not my favourite, along with Leon. I do like them both. Well, they were the two that introduced me to this franchise, so... Leon and Claire will always have a special place in my heart. I don't know about you guys, but Leon and Claire are my two favourite Resident Evil characters. 
Yeah, okay, but yeah, this game is fantastic. Does this game hold up? Um, does this game still hold up um, compared to um, Resident Evil 1? Of course it does. Does this game have more replay value? Of course it does. I revisit this game every year. I play this game every year because this is just my favorite Resident Evil game. But now the remake is out, I will definitely be playing that game too. I love Resident Evil 2. I just can't express that enough. But yeah, this game is a solid 9 to 10 out of 10 for me. Because this game adds a lot compared to Resident Evil 1. As you can see, you get extras in this, which you will see. But I'm going to see my rank first, but this is fantastic. I love this game. I, I cannot damn, give this game enough. I will do a retrospective when I review this game in my own words, but I don't think I've done this game enough justice. Honestly, that's how I talk. Anyway, I just don't think I have. And as you can see, I beat the um, game in 2 hours 58 minutes under 3 hours. A rank, Leon B, number of saves, zero. Yes, I um, up, I upload them a bit later, but I did beat this in one sitting. I do upload them a bit late, but yeah, I did beat this in one sitting. So just letting you know, I did sit here for three hours playing this game. But I just upload them at an um, amount of time, and um, I do pre-record the commentary and whatnot. So yes, I do... Um, played them in one I did play this game in one sitting I bite the zero saves and I just pre-recorded my I just recorded my commentary in the game with the controller while I'm you know you get it but yeah what I'm gonna do because um, the, the saves glitch here so I'm gonna press slot two and I'm going to save here and clear a oh yeah clear a scenario first I remember this, and you can now play another scenario if you make a new save data, which we will do, and that's Hunk scenario. I'm pretty sure we unlock Tofu's as well. I think we got to beat Hunk's one to unlock Tofu. So yeah, I will be doing these game modes. I definitely will, but we're going to create another save file. See, the glitch in this game is, the glitch with this game is that um, if you press slot 1 on the emulator, if you do press slot 1, it will freeze, so you got to um, do it on slot 2, so that it doesn't freeze. So when we come back, folks, I will be playing um, Hunk Scenario, um, the fourth survivor. <laughs> until then, until then, thank you guys for watching, and I shall see you guys in the next episode of Resident Evil 2. Samurai TX90 plays the fourth survivor. Anyway, take care, everybody. Enjoy the rest of your day. Farewell.